In this era of blockchain gaming and GameFi, medieval NFT card games represent a particularly favorable niche among gamers. If you have no idea what medieval NFT games are, today I've come up with one of the games that fall into this category. The game goes by the name War of Trolls, which is a blockchain-based play-to-earn card game. While playing the game, you'll be able to collect, trade, and battle with rare non-fungible tokens (NFTs) to create unique armies of trolls. So, in today's video, I want to walk you through the corners of this game and what it has to offer you as a player that will make you want to come back for more. Welcome back Metaverse Monopolists, I'm not a financial advisor, this video exists solely for educational entertainment. Please make your own research financial decisions. Now, the gameplay of War of Trolls follows a simple but engaging system, where players get rewarded for battling against other players' armies. As players win and lose battles, their army's strength increases or decreases accordingly. This creates a world of tension and excitement, as players build up their armies and prepare for intense tactical warfare. The game boasts an array of unique characters, from dragons to knights, that can be collected, bought, and sold in the War of Trolls marketplace. Each character is represented by an NFT, which offers a one-of-a-kind digital asset to prove ownership and scarcity. Additionally, all NFTs are playable within the game's metaverse, allowing players to experience their characters in full 3D glory. In other words, in the game, you'll start with a handful of characters, such as dragons and knights, and each represented by an NFT. Notably, the characters of this blockchain game are issued in the form of NFTs to ensure true ownership and scarcity, so you can be sure that your army is truly one of a kind and appreciated in value as well, depending on the market. What you should know is that your army won't just sit idle. Any time is time for battle. This means that at any time you have the chance to fight other players' armies as you strive for victory. As you win or lose battles, your army's strength will increase or decrease accordingly. Do you have what it takes to create an unbeatable force? This is your time to put your tactical skills to the test and find out. I always like to play a game like this, which involves strategizing my battling style with my troops and venturing into the opponents with it. It becomes so amazing and sometimes addictive. Moving on, the war doesn't end there though. In addition to its thrilling combat system, War of Trolls offers players many ways to earn rewards which are provided in the form of cryptocurrency called DELX, which is a cryptocurrency asset awarded to any player who wins the battles in the game. Talking about earning rewards, you can purchase more characters or upgrade existing ones to win more battles to earn more rewards. So, if you're like me and you want to play games that involve a world filled with action and adventure, then this game is going to quell your desire while earning real money because along the process of fighting epic battles against the enemy forces, you will collect valuable NFTs that you'll be able to trade them on the marketplace and earn real money. Speaking of earning, do you want to make a side income by gaming? If so, check out our favorite crypto gaming ecosystem using the link in the description. Now, let us talk about the tokenomics of War of Trolls. So, the game has a governance token dubbed DELX, which is limited in its supply and is obtained on the principle of hash rate distribution, which means as more cards are mined, the cards get put into circulation. This token is vital for the game ecosystem, as it has several important use cases such as upgrading or creating NFT cards. What astonished me about this token is that its emission is constant and during the gameplay, the token is not burned out, but staked in the NFT card and in various game funds. So, this is the game you can start playing and earn real money while having fun. If you're interested, you can explore it more by visiting its socials and official website. Additionally, there's this game called Dragon Sea that has struck a chord in the gaming industry. If you'd like to start playing this game, just check out its review before starting by clicking the tab you see on your screen, and we'll see you inside the metaverse.